All right, y'all, today we're gonna to talk about three great reads to use when your primary defender who's guarding you is in a trailing position. So say I'm driving in and I'm going and I realize my defender is, maybe there's either space between my defender and I or he, I can feel him, but he's trailing to where I have the advantage at the rim. Read number one is gonna be what we call a beer finish, okay? If someone's trailing me like this, I don't wanna just stay in a straight line because that would give them space and timing to still get back and alter my shot. What I wanna do is step down in my line and then as I feel them trailing, step into their line and then finish out. The three keys are this. Number one, as you drive, step down. Key two, step in. And while you step in, get your shoulders like this. You're not gonna like elbow them in the jaw, but if you get your shoulders out and extended, and then finish out, it's gonna be way harder for them to affect your shot. So again, three steps. Number one, down, in, and out. That's a veer finish. I'm gonna show you more half speed. I rip, down, in, finish out. And again, really get that elbow working. Here it is, more gain speed. I rip, down, in, finish out. That's a great move to use when your primary defender is trailing. Second read, a same foot finish. Now that, now we driving in, maybe this defender has length, maybe they're a good shot blocker. We wanna mess up and alter their timing. So in this, yesterday I posted a video on getting into bump, same foot, extend out. This is gonna be more of a quick step and underhand scoop forward. Cause they're trailing, so we, need, we don't need to go out if they're trailing, we wanna, they're here, we wanna step up and then extend out or forward, okay? So half speed, it looks like this. I drive in, I go same foot, oh, extend forward, and I finish. Three keys on a same foot finish. Number one, you're gonna drive and dribble and you're gonna go ball and right foot, then you're gonna get your left knee up. Step three, you're gonna extend out. So right step, left knee up, extend out. Here it is, gain speed. I'm driving in. Oh, quick step, left knee high, finish out. Same foot finish. Number three, you can, you can have some freedom on this third one, but it's gonna be any kind of reverse finish. So I could drive in, maybe my defender's trailing, but I see their arms go up, where maybe a same foot finish wouldn't work. Maybe I didn't really get a veer in. I didn't really get contact. There's, maybe there's a little bit of space between us so they can kind of like, they're timing us. That we think that basically that they might block our shot. So a great read to do is as they go up, we can either A, right, left, reverse finish. We can B, get in here and go right foot, left hand finish. Those are gonna be the two main reads on our reverses. So you got freedom on which one you wanna do. I'm gonna go through both. So the first reverse is I rip, right, left, and then I finish with my right. The breakdown on that is this. I dribble, I go right, left. As I sit with my left, I slightly turn my shoulders, and then I finish up with my right hand. That would be option one. Option two would be, I'm driving in, maybe I wanna go same foot throughout the timing, but then I wanna scoop under his arms and finish this way. So the second variation of reverse would be a reverse roll. So I'm driving in, I go right step, oh, extend out, finish with my left. The steps on that one is take a dribble, right step, left arm extend, left knee up, extend out with the left. Three great decisions to do against a defender who's trailing you, okay? I would say do 10, do 10 same foot going right, do 10 veer going right, do 10 any kind of reverse finish you want going right, then repeat those same steps going left. Towards the end, like we always do, mix it up. So maybe I might drive right one time, boom, oh, veer finish, and then I get the ball. Maybe then I go right again, but now I go, uh, oh, same foot, finish nice and high. Do 10, then go left side. Maybe left, I go here, oh, real, oh, now I go reverse finish finish high and I just keep mixing it up over and over and over. That's 80 finishes against a defender who's slightly trailing you.